Hey YouTube, this is my last video for the night. I'm kind of excited. I've done like three already. <laughs> so I've gotten a lot of questions on whether I do product reviews and I do. I love doing product reviews. I am a researcher. If I haven't used a product, I will research it for you. Ask any questions you want and I will review what I have, what I've had, what things my bosses have had in terms of toys and baby products. Um, I've been around kids and babies and in all kinds of different capacities my whole life. So um, I'd love to share my information and my experiences and I'll do that on pretty much anything. So I'm very open about things so feel free to ask. So this product review is for the Clear Blue Easy Digital OP Case. Now, um, I actually had <laughs> I had stuff here to show you guys. Ah, they're in here. So, let's go over how to use them first, because that would give you a little bit better of an idea of where did it go. Okay, so they come in this box. I get the 20 pack, um, just because I have you, I OPK every day, twice a day. It's a bit cheaper to do it in 20 boxes. Anyway, they come in box. There's a bunch come like this, 20 of these things. So you would open this thing and here is the test strip. There's a little arrow. This is the reader. So you take it arrow to arrow, insert it until it clicks. Did you, I don't know if you heard that, but okay. So then you'll get this little icon at the top. Now, if there's an icon like that, that means an error, okay? No error. So, at that point, take the cap off, and you can do one of two things. You can either pee on the stick. If you're a pee on a stick addict, you'll love it. Um, pee on the stick five to seven seconds. Um, or you can dip it in a cup, which I dip in a cup. For 15 seconds. Now, the only thing that I've found hard about the clear blue ones is that you have to hold your pee. <laughs> you can't pee for four hours or drink for four hours before you OPK with these. So that gets kind of hard for some people and I understand that, but it's so much more worth it to me. Um, when you eject it, so let me backtrack a little bit, sorry. When, huh, when you OPK, you pee on the stick, you'll wait three minutes, and it does, it takes three minutes. When the three minutes is up, you'll see one of these. Either a empty circle or a smiley face. Now, this shows the circle as complete, but there is actually a little tiny spot that doesn't show in the smiley face at the very bottom like of the face there's just a little dot that doesn't connect so you'll either get smiley face no smiley face smiley face means you have an LH surge which means you're about to ovulate LH no surge okay then you have 24 to 36 hours after your last OPK till you ovulate once you get your smiley face or no smiley face you push the eject button um, the last couple ones I've gotten, I have to kind of hold down hard. Um, I don't know if they've just been bad ones or whatever, but, um, and you'll see lines, two lines, a control line and a test line. Now they tell you, do not pay attention to the darkness of this line. The darkness does not mean pretty much, it, it means you ovulate, but, um, in other brands, you have to do line reading, and you don't do that with this brand. So, if you see two lines, this is the test line, this is control line. If it's not as dark, obviously, that does not mean that it's negative. It's just why they tell you not to pay attention to the line darkness. This is what it looks like when you have a happy face and a lighter line. See? So don't pay attention to the darkness of the line. 
Um, doesn't necessarily matter with this brand. Other brands. I hate interpreting lines. Whether it's the same darkness, and what if you get same darkness, and the next time you get darker, and it's just a mess. Like, I hate those ones. I've used them all, and I hate those. This is very clear cut. Smiley face, no smiley face, yes or no. Okay? And then you BBT. If you don't BBT, I would definitely recommend taking it up, especially if you're going to do OPKs. And you'll know whether you ovulated. Um, things that I don't really like about the clear blue, you can't pee for four hours and you can't drink for four hours beforehand. That's kind of a pain. So it's easy in the morning once I slept, but in the PM it's a little bit hard. Um, and it does do the 24 to 36, not 24 to 48, which is kind of nice. There are other brands, the Answer brand and the all the other that have the reading your, the lines brands um, most of those you can't use to FMU which is for first morning you're in if you're new to all this and that's kind of annoying um, some have a window like 12 p.m. to 4 p.m. and some it just kind of gets ridiculous so it depends on your personal preferences as to how often you pee I'm kind of a camel, but this is definitely the easiest um, to tell when it's positive, when it's negative, and it just, it's my favorite. Um, I've never had any issues with it. I've never, um, I once had a digital reader that wasn't working properly. I called the company. They got me a brand new box, not just the reader. They sent me a brand new box with 20 test strips. The next day. I got it the next day. So they've just been a really great brand. And I'll post the link below to their brand. I get them on Amazon. It's a little bit cheaper. And I just kind of keep my stash. So if you have any other product reviews that you'd like me to do, feel free to ask. I'd love to give product reviews. Um, and I mean anything. I may be trying to conceive, but since I've been a nanny and all that, I have product reviews for toys and strollers and things up the wazoo. So, just let me know what you want me to review, and I'll do it. Other than that, I will see you guys later, YouTube. Have a good night. Bye!